Hello, thanks for tuning in. Today we're going to talk about the recently revamped use case explorers that can be found in Splunk Lantern and why a use case focused mindset brings you value. Splunk Lantern has hundreds of use case articles written by Splunk experts and strategically organized into separate use case explorers, one for security, one for observability, and one for platform. Within the explorers, use cases are conveniently categorized by product, actions, maturity, and industry. This is to help you easily find something relevant to your unique needs. They all contain prescriptive guidance on how to immediately get more value out of your Splunk data, as well as providing inspiration for your future adoption goals. I'm Ryan Smalley. I'm the core products me for the strategic operations team and customer success. I've been closely involved with the creation of the platform use case explorer specifically, and I'm excited to be talking about all three of them today. Let's start off by establishing a foundation for why use cases are so important and why they bring you value. At Splunk, our purpose is to build a safer and more resilient digital world. When we pursue this purpose, it focuses our collective efforts on helping our customers be ready for anything. We do this with our unified security and observability platform. You'll see examples in the Use Case Explorer that highlight the flexibility of Splunk's ingest by leveraging common and custom data sources equally, that highlight the power of custom visualizations to provide clarity and highlight the value of automating detections, investigations, as well as responses. The unified platform model frees the data by letting all of your teams leverage the same capabilities and tooling, but through the lens of their own unique needs. The use case explorers emphasize the value of having all your data in one place. You may have initially ingested events for one specific security use case, but you may find unexpected IT ops or engineering use cases leveraging the same data sources. This effective leveraging of your data helps you to get the most out of your Splunk investment and the use case explorers can help get you there. Both the security and observability use case explorers are now organized by a common set of resilience maturity themes. Customers who go on this full journey build greater digital resilience and are better able to deliver on their missions. Each pillar here can be thought of as a collection of use cases, the same use cases you'll find in our use case explorers. It starts with foundational visibility into your events across any number of environments. Next, as you start to analyze an increasing amount of data, you also have a greater need to prioritize what to act on. Once you have visibility and are empowered to prioritize better, you can become more proactive to help detect and address potential problems before they become customer facing issues. Finally, with all these elements in place, organizations can focus on optimizing their digital experiences. Here's the front page of the security use case explorer with more than 50 curated use case articles behind it and more being added regularly. Articles here typically have a dependency on a security specific product. In the prescriptive SPL examples likely reference an enterprise security macro or data model, all of which is well documented. You can see the same resilience maturity journey categories across the top, foundational, prioritized, proactive, and optimized. There are also the subcategories under each to better group specific actions. For example, under prioritized actions, the threat hunting category contains multiple use case articles providing details on common ransomware attacks and SPL detection examples. The observability use case explorer has a similar initial format with the same resilience maturity categories across the top. Here we have another 50 or so observability specific articles, and again, with more content added regularly. The subcategories below have clear dependencies on observability specific products, both in and out of the Ollie cloud environment. 
These articles contain step-by-step -step walkthroughs for configurations across each use case. And this includes some really cool topics like setting up OTEL collectors, ITSI service analyzers, advanced synthetic monitoring, and getting the most out of your traces. The Splunk Platform Use Case Explorer has well over 100 articles, also with more being added regularly. What you may notice is that it's structured a little bit different. There are a variety of use cases targeting six general industry verticals. These industries all have unique needs and challenges, and the use cases are tailored specifically to each. The security and IT categories have use cases that do not typically have any dependency outside of the core Splunk platform. The security use cases have nearly the same subcategories we saw earlier, but the examples assume you will not be using enterprise security and typically leverage standard SPL. Similarly, the IT use cases aim to provide foundational observability functionality, but assume that you aren't using any OLLI specific products and only reference standard SPL. Some of the most recent articles currently include use case guidance on brand new products like Edge Processor, which leverages SPL2 in streaming pipelines. Future manufacturing articles will also include use cases for Splunk's newly announced operational technology product, the Edge Hub. Use case explorers can be found on Splunk Lantern which also hosts a huge amount of additional customer-focused information. In addition to these use cases, you can find prescriptive adoption motions. These are a new set of articles across all three product lines that provide strategy and implementation guidance. You'll find product tips, getting started guides, best practices, and much more. It's really worth your time to do some exploring there. As you start to think about current and future use cases, it's important to remember that you are never alone on that journey. We have a massive community of passionate Splunk users around the world that you can learn from, whether you're new to Splunk or a seasoned practitioner. In the community pages, you can ask questions, get answers, share ideas, and connect with like-minded enthusiasts. We have customer success managers that focus on the strategic, operational, and organizational impact of Splunk's technology. They really help you get the most value out of your deployment. We offer world-class education taught by experts. And if you really need a push, professional services and on-demand services are avail available to help you get over any hurdle. Thanks for watching today please head over to lantern.splunk.com to check out the use case explorers we talked about today, as well as all of the other great customer-focused content.